Ever found yourself wondering about the fascinating life of a piranha? These freshwater fish, native to South American rivers, lakes, and reservoirs, are named piranha by the indigenous Tupi people. They are famously known as predatory, but in actuality, they are omnivorous creatures with a diet as diverse as their species count. Speaking of species, estimates suggest there are between 30 to over 60 different kinds of piranhas, each varying in size, with the largest ones reaching up to 50 centimeters long. Now that we've dipped our toes into the world of piranhas, let's dive deeper into their environment and characteristics. Where in the world do these fascinating creatures reside, you wonder? Piranhas primarily inhabit the freshwater expanses of South America, with a significant concentration in the Amazon basin. These captivating fish thrive in a variety of watery environments such as rivers, lakes, and reservoirs, exhibiting a remarkable adaptability to different aquatic conditions. But their reach extends beyond South America, as they've been introduced to other parts of the globe, including the United States and Bangladesh. Now that we know where to find them, what makes a piranha a piranha? What sets piranhas apart in the vast world of aquatic life? It's their singular characteristics that make them stand out. For starters, piranhas sport unique teeth designed for puncturing and shearing. Their bite is one of the most formidable among bony fishes. Size-wise, they range from 12 to 35 centimeters long, but the largest species can reach up to 50 centimeters. Imagine that. And speaking of size, let's not forget about the extinct mega piranha, which could stretch to an impressive 71 centimeters. Armed with such unique features, how do piranhas behave in their natural habitat? Can we debunk some myths about the piranha's infamous reputation? Well, let's dive in. Piranhas are often portrayed as ferocious predators, but contrary to popular belief, they often school for protection rather than cooperative hunting. Yes, you heard that right. These so-called dangerous beasts gather together more for safety rather than to launch a deadly attack. It's a classic case of strength in numbers where the group provides a shield from predators. So next time you picture a piranha, think of it as a timid creature seeking safety in numbers rather than a bloodthirsty predator. Having understood their behavior, what sustains these fascinating creatures? What's on the menu for a piranha, and how do they ensure their survival? Well, despite their infamous reputation, piranhas aren't strictly carnivorous. Their diet is surprisingly diverse, feasting on fish, other vertebrates, and even invertebrates. They also enjoy a vegetarian option, nibbling on fruits and seeds and cleaning up river bottoms with their detritus diet. In terms of reproduction, piranhas lay their eggs in pits and become fiercely protective parents, guarding their young until they hatch. In the end, piranhas are more than just the ferocious fish of legend. They are unique, intriguing creatures that continue to fascinate us. So, what have we learned about the life of a piranha? We've discovered that these freshwater fish, known for their unique teeth and strong bites, hail from South American rivers and lakes. They have a varied diet and interesting reproductive habits. Remember, the world of piranhas is much more than what meets the eye. So the next time you think of them, don't just imagine a ferocious fish, but a fascinating creature with a unique lifestyle.